Well, Dan, if you're just watching this, if people have tuned in and haven't been paying attention to the storyline of the last few days, this stems back, of course, to Monday night. Kevin Kiermeyer was trying to score. He slid into home plate. Alejandro Kirk, the catcher, makes the tag, and a card inside of Kirk's wristband came out. And there was Kiermeyer picking it up. Now, I spoke with Kiermeyer the next day. He said, yeah, I looked at it. I thought it may have come out of my pocket. I realized that it wasn't ours, but I wasn't going to give it back to the other side. He said, it's September. I wasn't giving it back. Matter of fact, he repeated that on a number of occasions. He said, I hope I didn't offend anybody. Well, the Blue Jays were heated. The Blue Jays were upset with what went on. They said, if there is anything we don't want the opponent to have, it's that card because it's the game plan of how we go up, go up against opposing hitters. Kevin Cash, the Rays manager, claims he was unaware about all of this until yesterday afternoon. He apologized to Charlie Montoyo, Pete Walker, and Ross Atkins. Charlie last night said it was, quote, agua under the bridge. And he said we have very above average major, major leaguers. So that, Kiermeyer said, is a dangerous thing. And now Barucki hits Kiermeyer on the first pitch. And it's just natural to wonder if this has anything to do with the yesterday and the, the card that he picked up at the plate. You knew nothing was going to happen in a meaningful moment. But with the Jays down six in the eighth inning, Kiermeyer is sure wondering if that was intentional. Kevin Cash sure thinks that was intentional. Yeah, he wants him thrown out of the game, and that was obviously what was going on as Barucki hit Kiermeyer, and oh, nobody knows if he was ordered to or he did it on his own. But Kevin Cash understands what it was all about. The game is out of hand. It's seven to one, and Kiermeyer. Takes one in the middle of the back. That's not a good look on the Blue Jays for me. I don't believe Barucki was tossed out. We didn't see that. And now the four umpires are huddling on the infield. Right between the numbers. And that's the place you throw at somebody if you want to hit him because the hitters reaction is to back into the baseball. The problem I have with this is George Springer is your third hitter. Then Marcus Sivia. And that's not what you want to happen at this point. And all of this because of that scouting report that was dropped on the field and I, I just I don't think that was a good look for the Blue Jays. And given that Joe West is yeah. talking to Ryan Barucki, it looks like Barucki yeah, has been passed up in the game. Yeah. Yeah. Joe West, the crew chief, they had a conference, and Barucki was thrown out of the game for, in the umpire's mind, intentionally hitting yeah. Kevin Kiermaier. Well, and I'll tell you what, Buck, he might get suspended for this, right? And now Charlie is trying to keep Pete Walker in the game. We don't know. Is this the frustration of the day given the way the game is gone? Is this the way the Blue Jays feel about the principle of the thing with Kiermaier picking up the card? We don't know. We won't find out until you know people talk about it after the game. But you know given given what happened yesterday I don't know about you but given what happened yesterday it doesn't really surprise me that they tossed him out of the game. Well there was so much talk about it and everybody you know what Joe's the umpiring crew chief Joe West and he's talking with Charlie right now and you know what they didn't have to throw Brucky out of the game they could have just let it go and say OK he hit him and you know, there was no intent behind it but now of course I mean you could I mean I'm going to tell you right now if you're going to hit somebody that's how you hit him throw right in the middle of his back the leadoff batter here and then Kiermaier says something to Barucki and Danny Jansen and Bruce Dreckman get in between Kiermaier. And Pete Walker is after Joe West. He's protecting his pitcher and he's upset by the whole incident of the scouting report and all that stuff. And Pete's really obviously very upset.
some very interesting logic there. Yeah, it was probably intentional, but they could have ignored that and ignored the rule. If you want to see that it's intentional, watch Barecki's reception as he enters the dugout. Yeah, you get clubhouse points, but all of this evidence suggests it's intentional, which means suspension. I believe Barecki's going to get suspended. And the other thing that's happening here is now Nate Pearson's got to come in and pitch. And you'd, you'd probably like Nate Pearson available tomorrow. So we don't know if Barucky did it intentionally or not, but there are consequences for this kind of thing. And the Blue Jays are, are going to have Absolutely. to deal with that. You know, pitchers can be thrown out of a game without warnings. Uh, I think some people think before warnings you can't do it. And Joe West, they have a, the four umpires have a conversation, and he says to Barucky, you got to go. Yep. And you're a better Ripley uh, lip reader than than I am, Buck. I don't know how much you got there. And was it something? That's about exactly the wrong, what he said. You got to go. And the wrong and time he, or something. Yeah. So just for fun, let's see what Tampa Bay thought of it. We talked about it early in this game, and that was absolutely on purpose. And everybody in the building, anybody watching this, knows it. If if they don't eject him, then it's free game on anybody you want to hit. I, I mean, look, and you got Jansen setting up outside, and Barucki saying, "You know what? Here it is." I mean, th this is this is easy. You got to send him to the shower. You absolutely have to eject him. You can't allow him to stay in the game. Yeah, Joe West just said you got to go. Someone needs to unplug the coffee machine. <laughs> I'll tell you, behind the dugout. My good lord. Yeah, that's. Over the top, but and for what? It's real simple. He threw at him, yeah. clear as day, and they sent him to the showers. Yeah. Just hope that the Rays don't uh, return the favor in the bottom, the, the top half of the ninth. Yeah. Well, that, that's another reason. I, I mean, if you've got to eject the pitcher. 